darling, the 20s are not for you to find your person. Your 20s are for you to grow, to learn, to discover, to become, to heal, to travel, to see, to experience. There is so much beauty in giving yourself the time to get to know yourself apart from a partner, apart from your family, apart from your friends. Discover what you value. Think about what it is that you want for your life. Apart from the influence of other people, figure out what you believe and don't believe. Consider where you want to live, whether or not you want to have a dog. Do not waste this time looking for a relationship. When if it's good and it lasts, you'll have it for the rest of your life. Take this time to prioritize your relationship with yourself. Get curious about why you are the way you are. Learn from your past. Learn from your mistakes. Discover what you value. Take your future seriously and become aligned to what it is that you actually really want. Slay singleness with me. Women like her annoy the hell out of me because they continue to pass on this toxic advice when they know. They know it was a setup to keep them single in their 30s and their 40s. Stop it. Get some help. They know if they could go back, they would have be intentional with dating. They would have prioritized dating and relationship. Find them a man in their 20s so they don't have to be old and alone in their 30s and their 40s. But instead, they continue to repeat the toxic narrative that keep them in the hole that they're currently in. Man, this is some bullshit! Let's think about it. If you lose 90% of your eggs by the time you are 30, why on earth would you spend your 20s knowing yourself? finding yourself. This is the same self you were born with. Why do you have to be finding yourself for 20 years? 20 years pass and you mean to tell me you still don't know yourself? Let's think about it, y'all. Why not spend your 20s getting to know the man who you're going to spend the rest of your life with? The man you want to grow old with? Why not mature, evolve with that man? Instead, they encourage you to live, be alone. Basically, what they're telling you is to get used to being alone. You're going to spend your 20s being alone. And when you hit your 30s, what well, do you think you're going to all of a sudden know how to work with a man? You get so used to your space. You get so used to having your own, doing your own thing. And then now at 30, at 40, a man is just going to come and you're going to know what to do with him. You're going to know how to be a wife, how to submit. No, these are things that you should be practicing in your teenage years and in your 20s. But let this, th let these feminists tell it. They will encourage you to be by yourself, get used to being by yourself. And now you're so hard to get along with when you're 30 and you're 40 and you end up 80 and alone trying to fool the internet that you're happy young ladies let me encourage you to be strategic with dating as i said you lose 90 percent of your eggs by the time you are 30 if you want to have kids it makes more logical sense that you prioritize dating and relationships in your 20s you can always go back out after your kids are older to explore the world to travel and the best part is you will be traveling with the man who you are going to spend the rest of your life with you will be creating memories with that man it's just a more logical approach to dating as i said if a 40-year-old woman is giving you a dating advice how to end up like her and you don't want to end up like her single and alone, it is best that you don't take that advice. Think about it. This lady in the clip, she looks, she looks bitter and alone. I said what I said. You don't want to be bitter and alone, so do not take her advice. Be logical. Be strategic. If you want to grow old with someone, find that person in your 20s grow mature and evolve with that person you've been your same self since birth sis you don't have to get to know yourself if you don't know yourself by the time you're 20 mental issues going on there there is nothing about yourself you gotta go out and find because you've been the same you for 20 years ma'am when i tell you these bras are giving you all these advice to set you up to stay single to be 80 and alone y'all be strategic pay attention, and be intentional. All I can do is put the information out there. I cannot force you to take it. I know there's so many information that's advising y'all to find yourself and learn yourself and put men on the back burner, but hear me out. The kind of man that you would want to marry you is not going to be treated as something that you are now ready for after you gave your best years to the streets. 
some of y'all even become baby baby mamas unfortunately after you've given your best years to everything else now he should get the what left no nah, it's it it's that's just selfish think about it meet a man learn to work with him grow with him mature with him evolve with him so you guys can grow old together it is your girl shine so leave your thoughts in the comments don't forget to hit the like button hit the subscribe button i'll see y'all in the next video take care